Over 20 tornadoes hit five different states yesterday, and thankfully we were spared. But 96 years ago, parts of the tri-state were not. As a monster of a tornado came through, here's a look at the path. It all started around 1 o'clock in the afternoon in Missouri. It continued its path across the Show Me State, then into Illinois, demolishing the town of Gorham. And not long after that, the twister was about a mile wide coming into Indiana, demolishing Griffin, damaging parts of Owensville, but luckily falling apart shortly after that. Now, once all the surveying was complete, officials determined the path of destruction was 219 miles, and the tornado stayed on the ground for three and a half hours. It was rated in the F5 with winds of 300 miles per hour or greater. 2,027 people were injured and sadly 695 were killed. Now this remains the deadliest tornado ever in the United States with the second deadliest occurring in Natchez, Mississippi in May of 1840. And that one was 317 people that were killed. Now thankfully for us here in the tri-state, our weather is looking nice and calm with no severe weather and a very good looking weekend ahead.